When Sancta was founded, it was a college for Catholic women and the bishops wanted it as a nice, safe little place. But these women had a bigger vision than that. The underlying values of the college were drawn from the Catholic faith. But anyone who valued the things that were valued in the college was free to come. Sancta's future is firmly embedded in its past because Sancta has always been a place of community, of academic endeavour, of personal growth. It needs to always continue to be that. It needs to continue to be a home away from home. The academic side of Sancta is obviously what we're really here for. That's the core business of every student who comes. So we're looking at what they're doing what's making them successful and, and trying to then look at the rest of our students and see what we can provide for them, like tutorials, mentorships. So that's so exciting because that's what we are here for. My time at college certainly helped me on the road to where I am today. There was a real concentration on making sure that you really did your studies and you did as well as you could at university. Quite an important factor though was the fact that there were girls above you and a few years above you that you could talk to about the very same subjects that you were doing that they had done a few years before. I guess it was a passing down of wisdom which is very much what I think Sancta is about. I guess that's sort of how Sancta put me on the map and where I am today. In my opinion the value of college comes back to being together with other people you might not come across in your life otherwise. That always calls up this idea of being inclusive which is at what our college really strives to provide its students. So there's that value of risk, getting to know others, doing things you haven't done before. The value of college is about friendship and community. Sanctuary as a college provides a place where you can get to know other people in a way that is genuine. Walk in wisdom means that you start to take control of your life a little bit by learning to know who you are. And it means in a way that you learn to know the gifts you have, you learn to accept them, I think Sancta has evolved with a greater level of, of management, a lot more focus on how the girls can maximise their time at Sydney University, especially with their studies. I think there's a sharing of knowledge and wisdom right from the principal and other members of the staff to the girls to help them in every way possible, to give them every opportunity. That's so valuable. It's such an advantage for girls coming to Sancta. I, I'm not sure that many people realise is that academically Sancta performs well above the average. That's to do with the students themselves, but it's also to do with the culture and the atmosphere of the college. The number of students that we had admitted to the Dean's List at the University of Sydney this year would blow your mind. The number of students that we have achieving high distinction averages. Academically, students do better when they're at Sancta. And finally for me, even as an alumni, the idea of friendships that travel with you. Friendships that I would, I would never have had if I hadn't been here. And so those enduring friendships are very much a part of Sancta, but I think also this experience of university and this time of your life.